What is going on guys, Tiswafa here and welcome back to some more Ark Valgaro. Now last time we left off was yet another pretty crazy episode where I struggled to place down a big old gateway over here so we finally have this gate over here which is awesome. As well as uh, well we, we lost our, our, our wyvern, our, our, our celestial wyvern unfortunately we're out trying to kill some origin things like that just get like one or two more origin blooders I think we're missing you know that or origin soul I forget uh but yeah we're out and about we were killing some origins killing some uh, other things like a primal raptor and then suddenly our, our wyvern just gets killed and I even got some comments of you guys saying yeah you know that, that that tech raptor that like pinned you in apparently it does a lot of damage over time maybe it attacked the wyvern and because i think my wyvern set the pass mode i never really even noticed it because it was just standing still taking the damage and i guess it just drained its health over time so that really sucked but hey it opens up an opportunity for us to finally tame that rg that celestial rg you guys have been wanting me to tame for the longest time so hopefully we're going to be able to do that here pretty soon maybe even this episode as you can see uh, over here we have some fabled eggs between this episode and last episode i did get another fabled tyrann on uh this one over here low level as heck uh, it was really easy to find and tame this one because, of course, now that we have Pugnacia gone, more of these fabled things are spawning in, which is crazy because if I go over there, actually, you know what? I can show you guys over here, right? Uh, so if I go to fabled Paturanodon, there it is right there. Like, look at this. I can scroll for days over here. Well, never mind. I'm done. <laughs> but over here, <laughs> just taming whatever the lowest level one was. Oh, yeah, because on, on the scanner over here, don't show the male, female, all that kind of stuff. But, uh, yeah, I noticed on this Tyranodon over here, which is the original one that we had, that it actually laid eggs, or, you know, pooped rather frequently. Like, if I ride it, oh, oh yeah, by the way, I have a saddle for it, because I, I guess it's going to be our temporary flyer for right now, but of course, giving it a bunch of stimberries like this, look at that, poop, 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 over and over and over again. It poops pretty regularly, and I feel just like that, boom, look at that fabled egg right there, boom. I've even seen fabled eggs come out of its butthole, too, or, you know, yeah, its butthole. <laughs> <laughs> so, of course, that's just more proof that, yeah, this the Tyrannon is pretty good at laying the eggs. Like, maybe not the, uh, is that a star? Yeah, Triceratops over there. Maybe the star, oh, we know they are Styracosauruses. <laughs> maybe Styracosauruses over here aren't the best at laying the eggs. Same thing with the Morel Tops. Uh, it seems like the Tyrannon is just better. That's why I got a second one over here. And uh, this one I actually just rode and then just spammed all the stem berries right there. Just so I could see it, you know, poop in there, which is good. And then over time, I actually got a lot of eggs. And look at that, another egg right there. And uh, I, I got like, I'd say maybe 25, 30 eggs or something like that over here uh, in storage. I've already pre-made a few more demonic kibbles. Because you guys know what? In my inventory, we have that demonic reaper empress summoner doohickey thing. And I want to get some demonic kibbles so we can actually tame that thing. Uh, so I have 10 over here right now, which is good. Should be able to make a few more. I don't know how many uh, fabled eggs I have already over here. Where is that at? Here it is right here. I have 14. Okay, so I'm one away from making another one, but since we already have 10, I'm already pretty comfortable. I, I kind of want to like maybe make two more. Uh, what am I missing? Really? Caustic and fire feathers? Really? Man, I need to go kill like a griffin or something like that again. Golly. Thought I had enough. But we have 10 right now. We might be fine summoning this in with a 10 and maybe trying to knock it out and then hopefully we could actually get it you know now last time we had the wyvern which has millions of health this one over here has like what a hundred thousand if i had to remember correctly so oh whoops if i remember correctly so yeah a hundred thousand and i can give it a little bit more maybe a hundred fifty thousand yeah and I gave it a lot of movement speed, by the way, as well. I had like 180 or something like that percent previously, so... You know, it moves decently fast, but like... I'd be a lot more comfortable with my Wyvern, you know, so... That's why I kind of want to get that RG like you guys are talking about. Maybe it has a ton of health, because, you know, it's an RG. It's supposed to have a lot of health, but... Of course, it's going to be a little bit less agile, perhaps. Either way, I guess we could summon it in over here. I guess we could do it while riding on the Tyrannon, which is going to be good. Yep, there you go. Oh! And then I go on this cliff over here! Or is it there? Oh, gosh! There it is all the way over there. Now if I can hit it with these origin air- Oh wait, it's gone. Oh man, I went too far. Oh wait, no, it's underground. That's what it is. I see the smoke over there. Ooh, okay, hold on. Am I able to, uh... Yeah, I'm... Wait, hold on. Yeah, I'm not able to use my, uh, my, my stuff while I'm mounted on this, unfortunately. Oh, there it is right there. I see it. I see it. It's invisible. I'm supposed to make it really, really hard, you guys. I can't see it. I'll see the blur right now. It might be outside of render range. Where is it? Oh, there it is all the way. Oh, oh my gosh. I can't. Is it close? Is it far? Oh, is it close? Is it far away? I can't tell. Is, I, it's beyond that tree, which is good to know. Oh, is it coming over here, though? I don't know. 
Man, and I don't want to get on the ground or anything like that. I don't want to risk this guy dying. Where is he? There he is right there. There it is. I don't know if it's a male, female, or what. Hopefully it's a female so we can lay, lay some eggs and stuff like that, you know? It is a female. Level 840, so it's maxed the heck out. Which is crazy. It is a huge target, so... Ah... Uh, Man, I don't know. I'm just going to aim like that. Did it hit? I don't think it hit. Like, it was just a giant blur over there, and I missed. How in the world? Okay, let's get a lot closer, but... We still have to be very, very, very careful. Oh, my gosh. Ah! Did I hit it? I don't think I did! Where in the world? It's not even... It's completely invisible. Is it underground or something like that? It's actually invisible. Hold on. I think I just went through it right there. Ah! Something's happening. I don't have any more origin arrows. What is it? It's in the... It's in the ground. What? Why does it show a blur there if it's in the ground? What? And now it's under the ground? I guess the blur is to help show you where it is. Hey, look at that. There's Rudolph. But I guess I have to wait for it to come out of the ground and then I can shoot it. Which sucks. Man. Yeah, see, now it's coming out of the ground. Now I can shoot it, but I don't have any more arrows. Man. Uh, I wish I knew that. Uh, you know what? Let, let me see if I can reload. Save from like, uh, hey, a minute ago. Do we have a, uh, I don't know if we have any arrows a minute ago. I think I spent them a minute ago. <laughs> let me reload this save and see if it'll work. If not, I'll just do whatever one we did at the beginning of the episode. So, yeah, that sucks. I wish I'd figured that out beforehand. I thought it was, I thought it was cloaked whenever you saw the blur like that, right? But no, it's completely underground, and I guess that blur is just to show where it is. Uh, even though there's like a little digging, tunneling, little little animation that happens on the surface of the ground to kind of symbolize that, right? But whatever. Let, let me reload that save, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit, and hopefully we'll have some arrows back. Oh my god, you guys. I'm back. Heal up. There you go. Healing. Jeez. We spawned on like at the bottom down there, getting attacked, but I don't know if you guys saw that. I don't know where- Oh, it's right behind- ah! It's right there. It's chasing after us. Oh! It's still there, though. Jeez. Okay, okay. Go here. Nice, safe it away. Glad I had those, uh, whatever's there. Okay, there you go. i get this out. Whoops, that's the wrong thing. Where is it? We do have our arrows right now, which is good. Is it underground? Where is it? I think it's in the ground right now. Yeah, I see fire over there, but I don't see it, like, above the ground. Oh, wait, no, there it is. There it is. Let's get a little bit closer. No, it's getting like- Ah, oh, man. He's coming out of the ground. I can actually get it a little bit easier. Not waste any arrows or anything like that, you know? Somewhere over here. Oh, I see it, I see it. Oh, there it is. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Ah, got it, got it, got it, got it. Go, 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 go. Go, no! Man! Oh, that's a terrible angle. Man! Oh, we have to try it again. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Okay, okay, okay. Last time we loaded it in, you flew towards the Reaper Queen, and we almost got heck and killed, so as long as we stay away, that's good. That's good. If I could lure her over here, that would be awesome, too. Ooh, where is she? Oh. See the blur down there? Now, if I can hit her with, like, a shotgun or something, or, like, the sniper rifle, I know this won't do that much torpidity, but, like, i try and lure her out, if anything. Because I know my jetpack is nowhere near good enough, you know? I might have to go over there with the Tyrant on the train. Oh no! Now we got a heckin' yeah, I saw Oh jeez. Oh get it, get it, get it, got it! Nice! Now we're taking some damage over time. Man, lead I like five Nash right there, bleedings. Jeez. Why is it just stack up four times there? That's crazy. Okay, we might have to go down there, try and lure it out of the ground, and then try and fly away, because this thing has better movement speed than my uh my my jetpack, right? Now this thing's supposed to animate out of the ground and take a second, right? Oh, yep, there it is. Oh, jeez, it's supposed to take a second, but it's right there. Get out, go, go, go. What? Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 fly away! No, get out of the- What? You dumb, you- What? Is that a Tyrannus here? My Allosaurus should have despawned. He was preventing us from flying away. Oh, my gosh, that piece of trash. Oh, Okay, I was about to say third time's the charm, maybe, but now that was the third time right there. <laughs> Let me load it again, and maybe we'll have better luck this fourth time. Jeez. Oh, all right, we are loaded in. My Tyranodon, oh my gosh, it's all the way up there. It's not coming, oh. 
Okay, okay, okay. Let's go up here. Jeez. Oh, we were if I didn't have this jetpack, we would have been a gunner with that Reaper probably coming towards us hard. All right. Stop, stop, stop. Whew. Okay, there you go. Now, where in the world's that? You know what? You know what? Let me just make sure. There you go. Boom. Have that ready. I don't know if we had an RG if I'd be able to, uh, to fly by this thing. While, like, uh, fly, you know, fly on it and then shoot it. Oh, there it is right there. You know, while riding. I don't know if we could do that with the, uh, with the RG, but whatever. I know we could do it with that, like, oh, jeez. I know we could do it with the Tabahara, though. Oh, you know what? You know what? Here's a good cliff. If it's coming over here, this might be a good cliff. Ooh. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's underneath us. Whoa! Let's get on our jetpack. Lure it this way. Oh, hit it. Hit it. Hit it. I got it. I got it. Oh, my God. Tyrannon got killed. Tyrannon got killed. Ah, oh, that sucks. We have another one at home, but that sucks. That was a higher level one. That's our way out of here. Man. Oh, God. It's still following me. It's like right below me, though. I don't know how much, uh... Oh, jeez. There it is right there. I don't know how much torpidity it's at right now. Is that uh, 11 million out of what? It has 11 million torpedo out of what? 33 million. Thankfully, we have these second arrows here, though, you guys. Golly! Might as well go back there and get the uh, the dead body. Oh, man, it's so bright over here. Do I have, like, gamma turned on or something like that? I don't know. It is extremely, like, it's actually, like, pitch white, if that's a thing. I don't know what the white version of that would be. <laughs> you know, like, pitch black. I don't know if there's a pitch white. I still don't think so. Isn't pitch, like, the darkest thing in the world or something like that? Like, isn't there, like, some, like, syrupy type substance that, like, is, like, super duper, like, viscous or whatever? Either way, I'm getting to oh, oh, it's knocked out. Wait, hold on. Is it? Wait, how do I? Where is it? Wait, what? Oh, it's over here, but it's, like, invisible or? Well, there's a scout. Wait. Where is it? Uh, 12, I knew it, 12 demonic kibble, oh, golly, I knew I needed 12 for this. I don't know where to, oh, here it is, oh, it's up there, wait, what? This is so confusing. Oh, there we go, uh, yeah, I can give it the 10 demonic kibble right now, but we have 12 that we need. Golly, and we have one uh, Tyran on that we don't have right now, so we're going to need two more. And it's invisible. I don't know if anything's going to attack it while it's, while it's getting tamed like that, though, but... Yeah, man. I knew I should have gotten 12. I have 10 right now. Wait, no. Don't I have 12? I don't know how many I have right now. I don't know how many I just gave it. <laughs> Let's get all the stuff back from this. There you go. We got the saddlebag. We got some... A bunch of stim bears. I forgot I gave it those stimmies. Let's go over here. Let's go check them on it. Yep. There you go. Let's see. Yeah, I think... Yeah, I think it's ate all of the, uh, the, the ones that we gave it right there, because it has that on the torp or the taming's going down now. Oh my gosh. You have got to be kidding me. It ate all those. I can't give it raw meat or anything like that. Look at the taming. Just drop it like a rock. Oh, that's terrible. Man, so I have, to g I have to go back home. I need to reload the save, go back home, lay nine more eggs or whatever, and then get two more kibble. And Oh no, if I need more kibble, I need more of those feathers. Oh my gosh. Man, well, it sucks. I didn't even see how many uh, I needed it. Man. Okay, well, you know what? I guess I'll load it back. This sucks figuring this stuff out now, right? And look at that. It's, it's taming is all the way down to like half now. So I need like five more instead of just two more right now. So you know what? I guess I have to reload that save. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit. This really, really sucks, So I guess back. Yeah, I just need some feathers. I just killed a griffin, dark griffin near our base just a moment ago. Thankfully, that thing was pretty heckin' close. Uh, the unfortunate thing is that, yeah, my Tyrannon was unable to kill it on its own, so I had to, uh, I had to get my Celestial Sword out and then swipe at it a few times. Man, I don't know, I don't know if I killed or if the, uh, Celestial Allosaurus that spawns in. I don't know if that thing got the kill, but either way, this thing almost like and died during that, so. <laughs> we have 12 Demonic Kibble now. I guess we had enough eggs at home, which is good. Let's go over here. Let's go see if that, uh, Reaper's still over here. She should still be over here. She shouldn't have despawned or followed us or whatever. And if, I, I guess we could always check the thing and see if she's over here, right? The other. Uh, oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, there's the big blur. But this guy's like no health, so I kind of want to give him a health thing. I thought I just gave him one, but it didn't work. Yeah, it's not working right now. Man, that sucks. Golly. All right. Oh, jeez, there's the Reaper right there. Hey, that's a visit. Golly, I didn't even hear her. Well, there she is. Uh, We should go over here. Where is she? Okay, she's still following. We should go up here. 
Keep her nice and away from us. You know what? Let's go up here. Let's go up here at the top, tippity top of this. Then we can land. Yes, there you go. There's a man of armor up there. Okay, all that stuff. Whatever. I thought, whoa, 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 this is bad. This is bad. Oh. Okay, here we go. Compound bow out. Where in the world is she? I don't know. I don't know where she is. Straight up gone. Oh, wait, there she is right there. Blur right there. I see it. Man, I just don't want to get attacked by her, you know? Ah, uh, this is bad. I just need to lure her out of the ground, and I can't do that while on my jetpack. I need to be on the terrain, but he has, like, no health. Ah. Uh, this is such a predicament that we're in right now. We need to figure this out. Uh, if only we had that wyvern still, that would have been so much better. He had 10 or 20 million health, I forget. He had so much health, he could soak up so much damage, he had to do so much damage and everything there, but... Ah, we can't do that right now because he's like dead. Oh, we have an arrow in our. Oh, wait, no, that's the arrow. I was about to say we have an arrow in our knee or something like that. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, okay. I don't know if it took fall damage right there, but whatever. Okay. Ooh. ooh. I have to put this guy inside of a cryopod or something like that. And then we could heal him up. But I need to figure out where in the world the Reaper Queen is. Try and lure her out of the ground. There's Rudolph over there. Oh, there she is. There she is. Now if I could lure her this way, that would be awesome. Just fly, 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 fly. I don't know, where is she? Oh, just a big blur back there still. Oh, oh! She came out of the ground. What, what? See, she just appears out of the ground and then she starts digging into it. Like, there's no animation of her coming out of the ground. You know, it's kind of crazy. Oh, jeez! See, that's what I'm talking about! Go, go! No, now we're on fire. Now we're dead. Now we're dead. God, that sucks. There is no indication that she's coming out of the ground. She just boop, appears out of the ground, and then now oh, you have to deal with it, Ada. Ah, oh, man. No way of healing this guy up without putting us. Okay, let's do the crab pot thing, because I don't want to lose this guy. And I have no way to knock this thing out unless we come over here with, like, our celestial Indominus or something like that, I guess. Oh, we can't even. Have, there's nothing we could use to, uh, and then boom, take it out. There, there you go. We should heal up right now, right? Yeah, see, look at that. Stupid. I don't know why it has to do that, but whatever. 150,000 health, better than like 30,000 that we had just a second ago, right? So, there we go. Let's see, where is it? I don't know, but... Oh, there it is. See the fire. Oh, is it following us? I don't know. It's so hard to tell. Uh, it looks like it might be moving. I don't know. Oh, wait, no, they look at that. There's a Utorias. It killed us like two attempts ago or something like that. <laughs> I don't know. Man. Okay, it looks like it's following us. It's like right behind us. There it is right there. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Land, land, land. We have the arrow out. No, we don't, because we have to put the cry. Ah, oh, man. Hold on, hold on. Where is it? I don't know where she is. Is she underneath me? I can't tell. Where in the world? And we've got the mammoth attack. Come on. I thought the mammoth would be in. It's a fabled mammoth. There you go. Golly. Guess I'll kill it. Yep, there you go. Man, where in the world? This thing is so much harder than the Anominus because you just can't see it. And then it'll just appear out of absolutely nowhere. It's not even below us. Where? It's all the way over there. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can lure it back there now. So the blur is over there, but it's going to appear inside of me, right? Like it's going to be crazy like that. Oh. Oh, now it shows the animation of it coming out of the ground. <laughs> Come on. Oh, now we got the heckin' ice, whatever that is right there, attack us too. Ah, oh. Come on, no chainsaw, put that up. Where is it, where is it, where is it? Okay, she's like beneath us. Get a hit, we got a hit, we got a hit, let's get out, let's go. What, go, 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 why can't I move? Go, go, go! Ah! Oh my gosh! Now we just need to survive while she's hopefully being knocked out, right? Oh no, she's like right below us. Oh, I thought we had so much more room. She's at 10 million out of 33 million uh, torpidity right now, which is amazing. Just have to wait uh, 20 more seconds or something like that if I had to guess. I don't know. Time is just flying by and being super duper slow all at the same time. And when she gets knocked down, she's going to be invisible. So you can't even see her, which sucks. No, oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, I just wanted to kill that dumb. No! This dumb feather light. No! Oh, my God. Go get out of there. No, what are you doing? Oh my god! That feather light is such trash! Oh my god! I just wanted to kill that thing because I didn't know if it was going to attack us or anything like that during that, but then it attacked us anyways! Oh, now I have to go... 
kill the griffin again and stuff. I don't know. I'm like, we have a save from a minute ago. I don't know if it's going to help out, but I'll get it. Jeez. All right, I'll see you guys here in a bit. How many saves have I had to reload this episode? Like 10 or so with that by now? Jeez. Oh, I'll see you guys here in just a sec. All right, guess back. Uh, oh, I think I know where, where when we are right now. Let's see, can I heal this guy up? Oh, I can. Okay, that's good. Okay. That's before we put it in the crab pot and stuff like that. So we're in the world is the Reaper Queen. She's not below us. I don't see a big blur down there. Uh, probably over here. Yo! Oh! Yep, all the way over there. Yep, big blur over there. I bit see a big fire and everything over there, too. Oh, we got the mammoth over there, too. Golly. Okay, let me kill that thing real quick. So I'm going to try and lure it over here like I usually do. And, uh, yep. Okay, it's dead. I'm not even going to try and loot its dead body because I don't want to, I don't want to waste any time over here, you guys. Okay, every time I hear footsteps like that, I don't think it's even my terrain. I'm not used to it being my terrain. I think it's something else, you know? So where in the world is it? Oh, there it is right there still. If I can lure it back towards that cliff, that would be great. Because that cliff is huge. Should be a pretty good distance from us and the Reaper Queen. Okay, she's coming over here. You can see the footsteps and stuff like that. Okay, okay, this is good. Keep heading this away. Keep a nice, good distance. There's a Utah Rannis right there. Oh, uh, she's relatively far away. I don't know if she's still aggroing on us or anything like that. I think she might. Oh, I think she might be too far. Oh. I just I just need to get close enough to where she aggroes, uh, aggroes on us, but not too close to where she, you know, starts killing us and spawns inside of us or anything like that, you know? Golly, if I had, like, a, a attack, like a, a projectile attack, which I probably do, I just don't know about it. If I had something like that, like the Celestial Wyvern, and, you know, just get her attention, if anything. That would be amazing, but I can't. At least not with this guy. Okay, okay. Oh, she's getting really... Oh, she's out of the ground already. Holy heck. Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? Get off. There you go. Let's see. Where is she? Okay, she's like right below us. She's like right... Whoa. I got a hit. I got a hit. I got a hit. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Let the cliff... If she attacks... Oh my god, Tyrannon's dead again. Ah, oh, that sucks. But we got a hit on her, though. That's good. That's all that really matters right now. Oh, man. Well, at least there's like a billion Tyrandons around here, so should be able to find more of those guys, which really sucks because I just tamed one, but that was a higher level one, like I said earlier, so hold on. Oh, I see your tail wagon. Okay, she's at 15 million. Okay, she's at half torpidity right now, which is good. Do we have the, uh, okay, yes, we have, oh, I was supposed to say, did I load a different save that? We only had 10 demonic kibbles or anything like that, but we have 12 right now, which is good. Let's keep our distance. Let this, let this mountain soak up any damage she's trying to do to us, you know? Oh, I just don't know where she is right now. Oh, I see her little... Oh, she's at 27 million out. Okay, okay. I don't know if it gets exponentially faster with how uh, quickly it rises. You know, the higher it goes up or whatever. If it starts out slow and gets really, really fast. Okay, she's like... Oh, oh. Is that big flame? Oh, yep. That, I guess that big flame indicated that she's nice knocked out. Let's see. Now, where is her, like, hitbox? Well, oh. Okay, she just landed on the ground, I guess, right there. That, that noise was. Okay. Boom. Kibbles in inventory. That's good. That's good. That's good. Now, hopefully that's enough, because... Man, if that's like... It, it says she needs approximately... Yeah, approximately 12. I just gave her 12. If she needs 13, if she's at 99.9%, .9%, I'm going to be... I'm going to freak the heck out. I'm going to uninstall the game. I don't even care, you guys, at that point, right? <laughs> like, I spent so much time... Trying to knock her out and, and getting the kibbles and all the kind of stuff. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, my gosh. I thought it was going to get stuck there at, like, 93 or whatever. Holy heck, we got her. Level 12, 59, you guys. After all that, and she's invisible. I can't even see her. Really? Uh, is she going to come out of the ground? Hold on. She's set to follow me. Is she going to come out of the ground or what? What's, what's happening here? <laughs> what is happening? I can't see her or anything like that. Power up. How do I put a saddle? There you go. Now how do I power up, power down? How do I... She's stuck in the grounder. I can't unbury her for some reason. That's so strange. Okay, power down. Can she not unbury from like right there or something like that? What was happening? Is she just a big blur now? Like a kid? <laughs> really? Uh... Like, the, un the unburied thing is like... Hold on, here's here's better terrain right here. Here we go. Oh! Oh my gosh! 
What are the stats? 30 is that what is that? No, it's 3.4 million. I thought that was 34 million. That would have been inch. Hey! <laughs> now we do have a gigantic XP bottle at home. I forgot where we got it from, like a chaos thing or something like that. I don't know, but eh, only 187,000 damage from melee. Now, do we have some sort of Oh gosh. Yes, we do have some sort of like tail whip type attack. We're not even powered up right now, I don't think, right? So uh no, that's a different one. That's a big AOE sort of attack there. This is a projectile sort of attack, kind of like the thorny dragon, just a little bit less. I guess, I guess, like if I wanted to aim at something, it's kind of going all over. It's kind of like a shotgun, you know? Oh, and I killed a Tyrannon randomly right there. Oh, yeah, speaking of such, we should go find the dead body and <laughs> get the saddle back. You know, I'm like, it was like 500, uh, fabled hide or something like that that I needed in order to craft the thing, right? So I don't, I don't want to lose that, obviously. So I was like, grab over here and go give it to the other fabled Tyrannon, right? Then I'll have to tame another one or like two or something like that because those guys are, you know, decent at getting eggs. Or, yeah, decent at getting eggs, so I'm not going to lose that, right? Yep, dire, almost called it a dire bear. <laughs> dire wolf dead, that's good. What is this? Wait, what is it? Oh, the fabled mammoth dropped all that. Ooh, nice. It even had a uh, medium experience bottle right there. Cool, definitely want to give that to my, uh, my empress down here, but she can kill like anything and everything, so I think I need to worry about that, right? Gosh, he's huge. Look at that. Glad that we got that new gate last episode or else. Oh, or else I don't know how we I don't know. She still might just be too big to fit through the gate. <laughs> I don't know. I like, wasn't this thing still bigger than our Indominus Celestial Emperors or whatever they were called. Demonic Reaper Empress. Jeez, what a mouthful. <laughs> and we can give her like 255 level ups for one thing. I think we can give her like 300 level ups, right? So she might max out like level 1500, which is going to be insane. Let's kill Rudolph there. Ruin Christmas. Oh, whoops. Hey, we got some blueprints right there, though. Oh, you know what? We are in the area of the map, and I assume we just have a ton of, uh, oh, what was that? A Celestial Argy? What is that? It is! Level 560! Ooh! But it's a male, though, so... Oh, well, it doesn't really matter. We have a lot of Celestial Eggs at home, but hey, we should be able to get a lot of Demonic Eggs from this gal, right? Isn't this the female? Yes, it is. Now, why should we... Oh, oh both of our Celestial Indominuses are male, or female. Wait, hold on. Oh, that's Rudolph's dead body down there. This is female. Is it just like really, really likely for these? Well, then again, this is called an empress, right? So it, it just makes sense to be female. But then again, the other ones are male or female row, right? And they're called emperors. That is very strange. Fable Snow Owl right there. Probably could have got some stuff out of it, but whatever. I want to find some uh, Megamythicus and stuff like that, you know? Too bad if we look at the uh, scanner thing. I think we need to build like uh, 10 more scanners or something stupid if I wanted to see the actual map. <laughs> Whatever one of the scan dinos and stuff like that, you know? So that kind of sucks. Maybe I'll just go home though, because we do have a lot of stuff that literally spawns like right outside our base. Oh yeah, isn't there an Origin Rex or a uh, Chaos Rex? Like right outside of our base. I don't think we ever did destroy all wild dinos ever since finding that guy, right? So if we go over there, we should be able to find it and maybe kill it. But I don't know. I'm like, I kind of want to uh, tame it because we can still do the tier four boss battle, which we may end up doing with this gal because, you know, she probably has. Well, then again, the thorny dragon is like 74 million health, right? So hold on. You know what? 100. Jeez. How to get that many level ups that fast? OK, you know what? Let's look at her baselines. Health is pretty good. It's actually like the best. Actually, you know what? Melee is the best at 191. Health is really good at 183. Uh, other things are like 176, 189, 187, 171, 161. So you know what? Yeah, health is like actually the second best and melee damage is the best. So holy heck. We are running out of stamina somewhat though, but I, I'm like over time, like and we're just going to power down eventually, right? So we're at 3.4 million. Yeah, 3.4 million right there. It goes up to 3.6 and 3.8. So... Health baseline isn't quite as good as the uh, Thorny Dragon, I could already tell that. Like, I'm pretty sure the Thorny Dragon went up by millions uh, whenever we had that guy. Like, you know, we're riding around that guy. I guess she just doesn't play well with water. I wonder if she'll take a damage right there, just swimming around in the water. <laughs> that would have been crazy. But, oh yeah, some uh, some Brachios and stuff like that over here. I think they're Alphas or Apexes or something. Yeah, Alpha. Yep, both Alpha right there. Nice. Boom, dead. Probably got some good levels right there. I don't know. I can't see it. But uh, melee damage, you know what? So let's charge up. Oh, wait, we were charged up right there. Whoops. That's why we're losing the stamina. We're charged up right now. How much damage do we do? 300,000 for melee. Let's see, is there something for me? To oh, there's a mammoth right there. Now for this tail whip. Well, the projectile thing doesn't really do that much, but at the same time, it does a lot of damage over time, I assume. Oh, yeah, and then, like, things just near us just catch on fire. I just saw the terrain on randomly catch on fire. <laughs> We're just going crazy. Oh, yeah, and then we can go over here and we can take on Wyverns and stuff like that. I think Wyverns give a lot of XP for, you know, just a few thousand health or something like that that they have, right? So it's pretty good in that regard. So 
if I could find some Mega Mythicuses or some other bosses or something like that, that would be amazing. But I'm not seeing anything right now, which sucks. Now, what was that attack? So there's a lot of stuff around here. Yeah, look at that. Everything. Oh, 400,000 right there. Now, I've done no level ups for melee damage. So, of course, we're doing base. This is like our minimum. 400,000 right there. And then, like, only a few thousand or something like that, right? Yeah, only like actual. Well, something took a 45,000 right there, though. So, that was pretty decent. But at the same time, you think this thing would do way more damage than that. And this thing was like maxed out at level 840, right? So, I guess we'll do melee damage. Melee damage goes up by a pretty good amount. You know, let's get up to like 10,000 or something like that. Crazy. And then I'm like, we still, you know what? We could probably go to 15,000 or something like that. But you know what? 10,000 there and then health. Maybe we get up to like 10 million. Like it'd be, the Thorian Dragon has 75 million health. It'd be, it'd be amazing to have that much health. But unfortunately, this, this just then can't do that, you know? Let's do this. Is that going to heal it up? No, I guess I have to put it inside of the crap on. And then I could heal up with that. Man, I really, I still don't know why that does that. But the tail projectile thing. Still, why is this? It seems like it does like basically no damage there. Rock Elemental took thing, that thing down pretty easily right there. Sheesh. Can even go up this? I think I'm too big to go up this. Pfft. And of course we could burrow, but I don't think she can burrow with us, uh, with us mounted, right? So I, th I don't think that would work right now. Oh, and then, oh, and we pooped. I don't know if that was an egg or what, but a million melee damage. Well, some things are only taking a hundred thousand though. Oh, Celestial Wyvern right there. Hey, look at that. We contain that thing. Oh, it's only a, only a level 112. Did I just, oh, yep. I killed that Celestial Wyvern in one hit. What? The tail whip was a me Oh, we got Mega Mythicus over there. Oh, another one right there. Alpha Mega Mythicus. Pfft, trash. Boom. Oh my gosh, that tail whip is insane. And I don't even need to be like, oh my god, at 3.4 million right there. What? I don't even know how many levels we've done to melee damage right now, but I I, I need to be careful. Make sure I don't like reset or anything like that. If I do, then we, we might be able to get like some sort of mind white tonic that still works on dinos or something like that. Boom, killed him. Alpha Mega Mythicus. Toxic Pulmus Scorpius. God, we're killing these guys like it's nothing. It's not really uh, earning the that's a lot of damage meme from me just yet. It's doing very comparable damage to other things we've had. Thorny Dragon, though, that thing still is amazing. This just said this, this, this. I don't know. I'm, I'm debating in my head. Thorny Dragon versus this Reaper Empress, you know, versus a tier four boss. Oh, my gosh. 73 levels right there. So we've done uh, 15. Oh, yeah, we could do like 200 more levels to melee damage if we wanted to, you know, it's <laughs> crazy. So, uh, you know, what? maybe like 20,000. Can I do 20,000 percent melee damage? And we might be able to uh, not with the levels we we currently have. I don't uh, we're getting close. One 18.7 18,000 point seven or 18.7 thousand. So it's uh, 132 levels on melee damage and 33 on health. Uh, we have a uh, oh, yeah, we have medium there. We have a large there. Let's do a large. To only two levels right there. What? Uh, I guess we'll do melee, sure. And then a medium. Hey, one level up right there. Now, I don't know when this guy will, like, uh, like, max out or anything like that, you know? So, we need to watch out for that. Make sure we'll do levels on things that we shouldn't be doing too, honestly. And, yeah, we're doing well on food. We're doing well on stamina, which is actually kind of surprising. Kill Rudolph again for two million damage. Charge it up. Holy. Let's keep flying around here, though. Because, we, of course, we could find a lot of high-level things around here. Megapithecus is... Other bosses and stuff like that. Other Celestials, I'm sure. Buffoon Ferox down there. I guess we could do the... How do I do that? Oh, I can't do it while falling down a mountain. But uh, hey, there we go. We killed that thing, even though it did a bunch of like 9,000s and stuff like that. Oh, we're killing a bunch of Apex minions over here. There must be a... Oh, oh, oh yep. That's the Spear or uh, the Chaos Rex down there. And we have some Alpha Indominuses down there as well. Oh, just kill the Alpha Indominus randomly from a distance. Oh my god. Oh, an origin, uh, whatever right there, taking half a million damage just being in our our vicinity. Just being near us, that thing is taking so much damage. I killed the Chaos Bricks without even realizing it. What? I stepped on it and killed it. What? <laughs> oh my god, and there's the origin uh, right there. Oh my gosh, half a million every time it's like right next to us. And it has rapid regeneration, so we do need to watch out for that. It does look like we have low health right now, or like half a million health or something like that. But remember, we've we've given so many health level ups to this thing that it looks like we're half health. So I'd say we're probably. Oh wait, yeah, that's the uh, the origin right there. Still, yep, we're still powered up, so we're still doing a lot of damage. Still taking. Golly, that thing's taking half a million. But then again, it was, we're doing like oh, we're doing a lot of three hundred something thousands. I don't know what are we even. What are, what are we attacking down? I killed I killed a primal Karna without even realizing it down there. What? What? We killed origin things way faster with our thorny dragon. Maybe because we we were able to stack up or something like that with it. I don't know. 
Let's see, we have tons of stamina, so come on, let's do another ranged attack if I can. It'll stack up. Yep, boom. Bunch of 500,000s right there. Golly. But it's still nothing compared. Oh, Fabled Argy right there. Boom, dead. Oh, oh, Griffin over here. I need those feathers. Oh, I only got Ice Feather. Oh, it was only an Ice Griffin. Man, that sucks. There's that Origin over there still. So if we could do some damage to it from a distance. Do a lot of half a million damages over uh, half, every se half second or something like that. Still, though, like I said, the Thorny Dragon doing like a million damage or something like that every half second or quarter second or whatever that was. Still was better, in my opinion. I don't know if it stacks up, though. Like, every time I attack it right here, it's another 500,000. Every, every quarter second or what? But boom, there you go. Origin RG is down. Finally got it right there. You might have been hearing me spam clicking in the background, which I don't even really need to do that for this. Another 108 level ups right there. Golly. Now I, I need to actually start watching out. Make sure I don't over level this thing on uh, 135 on melee damage. Okay. So I could do another, like, hundred. Okay, I, I could do all these to melee damage. And see, look at that, our health is still going up. It's at 4.8. It was like 3.4 whenever we got this thing tamed. So, you know what? We're at 20. Oh, let's see if we can go to like 20. Yeah, we can go to 25,000. Boom, 25,000 right there. Do I want any more? Yeah, anyway, let's get let's get more health. We need more health. I don't know how much more. We might actually max out here. We're at 1477. Man, I don't know. How much more health do I need? Uh, or just how much damage? You know what? Let's do damage. Let's do damage there. We can do all this to damage. And still not max out the melee damage, which is insane. It hit 32,030.8%. God, oh, man. It's at 243, so I could only do uh, 12 more there until it, like, resets. Or, you know, 13 and then it resets, but 12 more and it's still safe, right? Uh, but, oh, there's a Fabled over here, though, so let's see. 3.6 melee with charge. This attack. Like, if I had another Origin thing, I don't know if we... I, I think we took, took all of our Origin summoning things, like last episode or two episodes ago or something like that. So I don't think we are able to use those, unfortunately. And we accidentally killed the Ape uh, Alpha or, uh, Chaos Rex. Just falling down the mountain, it just died randomly. I guess because it was in our aura or something like that. We just did so much damage to it there, it was crazy. Oh, what's that over there? I see something over there with like a Cheeto Duster at it. Seems like it might be pretty powerful. I don't know what it is though. Rudolph, oh yeah, it's... I don't know why Rudolph has the Cheeto Duster on him though, you know? Kind of weird. Yep, he's dead. Ruined Christmas again. I'm sorry. <laughs> and we have more uh, Alpha RGs, Apex RGs, whatever these are. Yeah, Apex RGs. And we have a Mega Mythic. It's just a regular one right there. Yep. Accidentally just killed her right there. Jeez. Yeah, she's level 1535. She probably only has like a few more level ups. Yeah. So what level should, was she whenever we take her? Like 12 something? And then you get like 300 more level ups? I don't know. I, these might be the last level ups here, you guys. And we've done a lot of melee damage. Oh, there's the... Uh, well, I don't know if we could hit a flying thing with our like projectile tail attack I could try but I'm like I'm not like a bot so I, don't, I can't like auto aim at her or anything like that and there is a significant cooldown between uh whoa that might hit oh it did it got the snow out and the fire wyvern that was crazy <laughs> that was amazing there's some random stuff up there I don't know what that was <laughs> maybe some things dropped some loot or something who knows oh what's this what's that oh it's just oh, an, oh wait what Wait, what is that? I saw some sort of... Oh, an Apex RG. I guess it just looked weird because the sun was setting or something like that. I don't know. Oh, the Toxic Direwolf right there. Yeah, we can kill that thing. No problem. Oh, jeez. Now I can, I think I can officially do the, the flex tape meme or flex seal or whatever. That's a lot of damage meme that you guys keep saying. <laughs> Golly. We need to summon in more origins or something like that to, to keep testing this thing out. But I think it might be actually maxed out in terms of levels, which kind of sucks because... Well, at the same, you know, 75 million on the Thorny Dragon, 32,000% on the me on the melee damage on this one. We have some pretty good uh, projectile attacks. I don't think the Thorny Dragon had that, like, AOE attack where we, like, spin in a circle, like, uh, what was it, this one? Oh, 5 million, golly. That is crazy. Now, she, can, she, can she fit through the door, though? I don't know. Uh, I can't tell, because it... Oh, what happened right there? Oh, I, okay, I uncharged, and, uh, why is the door not opening? Is I thought I said it to auto-open and close. Uh, oh, my player model's, like, I think it's way too far away, and it's not going to auto-open or close on us, unfortunately. Man. So, you guys remember last time, uh, I, 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 well, yeah, she is a little bit bigger, but the Indomitus are so long and stuff like that that I was able to open up the door without, yeah, see, look at that now, now, I guess she'll have to let her follow us in or something like that. And then she'll lay some eggs, which is going to be good. Going to get a lot of... Thor, or, uh, demonic eggs, which is going to be amazing. But we already have a lot of demonic eggs as is because of, uh, man. See, 
Uh, gate thickness. I don't know if there's a way to auto-close. No, just open it up. There you go. I don't know if there's a way to, like, like, what? I, I said it to open it, just cl man. Okay, okay, it's open right now. Is it going to close whenever? Oh, God, they're, oh, hey, look at that, make a thing is back there. It is closing, what? Man, I think I have to turn off the automatic or whatever. Or, geez, just killed it right there. Mesopithecus Gigantopithecus is, is all dead instantly, golly. And it's glowing around and stuff. And I'm not even charged up. Golly, this is insane. Yeah, I can't go through this right now. Okay, whatever. I don't know what to do. Maybe I'll set up like some sort of ramp or something like that to, <laughs> to make her go through. Because this is this is already a lot of trouble. And I don't... Oh, what in the world? Oh, that's our tail doing that weird trail back there. That's crazy. Either way, I, I guess we could end off the episode right here. A successful tame after like 10 attempts. Finally got her. She's really powerful. Next episode, I think we might... Oh my gosh, look at those eyes glowing and stuff. That is fierce. Next episode, we might be able to take on that tier 4 boss. It's just that... You know, 75 million health with the uh, thorny dragon down there. So, how much melee damage does it say here? 73,000% melee damage on that thing with 255 level ups and only 54 levels from health. Golly. Okay, well, she probably still has a level, a few levels ahead of her. She only has 243 on melee damage and only 33 on health, so... Yeah, You'd probably give her like a a few XP bottles or something like that, and then we'll be able to. Oh yeah, she has. To... <laughs> There's that twenty one number again right there, you guys. Golly. <laughs> so I, I can give her a few more levels here. She's probably going to max out here very very soon. But I, I'm still conflicted. I, I need to know in the comments down below what do you guys think? Demonic Thorny Dragon or Demonic Reaper Empress? Which one would be better for the tier four boss battle? Because we're definitely using either one of them. And I did get some comments from you guys saying, yeah, you could use Chaos versus Demonic or. Uh, spirit versus demonic. It doesn't matter. It, it, it only matters for like uh, like like demonic versus uh, demonic empress or celestial versus celestial emperor, right? I guess it only matters in that regard. I guess you could mix and match them up for tier four no matter what, uh, which is really cool. But 75 million health right there. That's a lot. And it does so much damage over time. And I don't know. Compared to this, I don't know. It's a lot smaller. Might be a little bit more agile if we're Trying to run away or something like that. I don't know. But then again, like stuff like this attack and just the big fire aura around us in general. And, you know, this this projectile right here and us doing like three million melee or something like that. You know, you know? it's like I'm so conflicted. This is it's a really close one with all that extra health that that guy has and possible damage output. Is, it's very tempting to, to use the thorny dragon still. But I'll let I'll, I'll read you guys comments. I'll, let, I'll, I'll see what you guys are thinking in the comments, like which one I should use like next episode. Uh, in order to do that tier four, I'll make sure I have all the ingredients to make the uh, tier four thing next episode. I think we're because uh, we were making the demonic kibbles. I think we're missing some ingredients. So I'll try and get those between this episode and next episode. But until then, I have to end off this episode right here. So thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button and be sure to ring that bell while you're down there. So you don't miss next episode where we're going to be either using our demonic reaper empress that we just tamed or our demonic thorny dragon down there to take on the tier four, most likely the chaos boss, which is going to be crazy. Uh, I just don't know which one of these I'm going to be taking it on with. So I'll be figuring that out between this episode and next episode. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Ark Valgaro. Oh, bye there. Oh, jeez. Hopefully I didn't kill any of you guys doing that outro. <laughs> oh, bye there.